An internet privacy is an issue that many of us worry about, but it can be hard to understand exactly how our data is being used. And it's just become a little more complicated. A controversial data pact has been agreed between the United States and the European Union, which means your browsing history could be used by companies you've never heard of in another continent. TRT's Surav Roy is here for us. So tell us more about the pact and why should we be concerned, Surav? The pact is between the European Union and US and it allows more than 4,500 American tech companies based in the European Union to gather and mine information and data from European users and send it to their servers in the US. Uh, why should we be concerned? We should be concerned because of privacy issues. A lot of European users do not know that their personal browsing records or their online history, such as the shopping records or their hotel reservations, flight reservations that they do online, are being sourced and mined and sent to US for further targeted advertising mm -hmm. by companies such mm -hmm. as Facebook and Google who mm -hmm. sell it to advertisers so as to make revenue mm -hmm. out of it. Well, so what? And if they're going to target me, and they know exactly what my shopping habits are, maybe that's a good thing. Not exactly, not always. Uh, what we know as privacy uh, is, is, is actually your own action online in the virtual sphere, which you do not want to be yeah. a public spectacle. Why? What's the worst that can happen? It's not about whether it can be bad or it's not about whether you're doing something wrong or, um, or illegitimate. It, it, is, it is about you and your own action. Uh, and you have the right to, to surf the internet without being uh, monitored by anyone. And you also have the right to use services such as Facebook and Google mm. uh, without being taken for a ride. OK, and this pact will actually diminish that right, is what you're saying, right, Sarah? To some extent, yes, okay. because it allows these tech companies okay. such as Facebook and Google to play with the data and to make money out of it. Okay. And uh, at the end of the day, uh, if you have to make money out of data, which is big data of billions of, of millions of people, uh, you are compromising on the privacy of so many okay. people. So, Roy, thank you very much for the analysis.